Welcome to Speaking French in the Past Tense. I'm Mr. Demarest, and I'm going to introduce the preterite tense, or the passé composé en français. This episode, created for French 1 class, is le passé composé with SF. The preterite tense, le passé composé, describes actions that began and ended in the past. For example, I am falling is the present tense, but I fell is the preterite. To form the passé composé, each clause must include a subject, auxiliary verb, and past participle. The subject is any subject, pronoun, or noun. Here are some examples. For the auxiliary verb, today, we will use être in the present tense. Don't forget to conjugate the verb with your subject. Next, I'll explain the past participle. For regular verbs, one forms the past participle with a simple adjustment to the infinitive. Aller would be aller, went. Partir would be parti, left. And descendre would be descendu, went down. Only a select few verbs are conjugated with essa in the passé composé. A helpful acronym to remember these verbs is Dr. and Mrs. P. Vandertramp. As you may have noticed, not all past participles are regular. However, we will deal with those at a later time. One important difference between using être and avoir as the auxiliary verb, past participles formed with être must agree in gender and number with the subject, just like adjective agreement. Plural subjects require the addition of an s, while feminine subjects call for an additional e. It is the combination of these aspects that means you are speaking in the past. Back to our first example. To say, I am falling, would be, je tombe. But in the passé composé, I would say, je suis tombé, I fell. Simple as that. Thanks for watching, and I hope you found my introduction to the passé composé with être helpful. Feel free to email me with any questions at rwdemarest at westliberty.edu. Au revoir.